Hey, Robert Jackson here. Today was the first day at the Florida State EBV program. Full day of classes starting at 6.30 in the morning for breakfast, running until about 10 o'clock this evening. Uh, very intense. My head's throbbing right now. A lot, of, a lot of information to take in in one day, but great information. There's a lot of resources, not only through the instructors, the speakers that spoke on their uh, topics, but through the veterans, uh, the networking there that's happening just within the veterans that are attending that own their own businesses that are looking to expand to the veterans that are starting up from brand new, barely have an idea on paper. Uh, they just, they know they, they got the entrepreneur bug and they want to pursue it. Uh, there's a lot of resources here to help you focus and get your ideas on paper, help them get them out, get them out of you, get them on paper, get them moving. Uh, tonight we worked pretty hard on our comprehensive plans. There was a lot of help, a lot of volunteers, a lot of people going around the room sharing ideas. Uh, not not to shoot anybody down because there there's there is no dumb idea. It's your idea. You're running with it. They're just here to help you, guide you, and give you every angle of your idea so you think out every angle to kind of manage that risk that you're going to take being entrepreneurs and giving back to your prospective communities and giving you all the feedback that you need to completely think it out, think it through to where you have that success rate that is double uh, the general public. I learned today that veteran businesses are twice as likely to succeed. I mean, we have the passion, we have the communication, we have the leadership, we have the discipline. We have the ideas. Now we have somebody showing us we have somebody teaching us. We have somebody guiding us through. It's kind of like having Big Brother hold our hand as we walk this new journey. Uh, we, we've all fought and prove our, proven ourselves in the military. We've all tried to continue on and thrive in everything we do. This is just another step for us to take, another road for us to take and, I guess, pave a new way. Uh, Florida State University, as well as the other universities, are given back to us in a way that you can't put into words. I'm sitting here searching for words to say what it what it means to the service members that are here, but interacting with each one of them that are participating and just seeing their, their dreams come to life on paper but come out of their head and see how excited they are and see how pumped up they are just to hear, you could do it, you could do it, you could do it. Believe in yourself. Don't, don't be scared. Don't hold back. Don't be reserved. Yes, keep that risk in mind. But keep it in mind that we're here to help alleviate as much risk as we can. That's the main message that they're portraying and giving us today was we're here to help. That's, that's the biggest thing to take back is you have somebody to talk to. You get the contacts to say, hey, what about this idea? How do you think this will work if I do it this way? And it, there's a lot of successful business men and women that are here at the event that are saying this is how I succeeded. This is how you could succeed. Uh, one of the gentlemen that's running the program has started 10 businesses. First person I think I've ever met that's got that bad of an addiction to something. Uh, that's, that's pretty impressive. And he's, after starting his 10 businesses, he got bored. So he, I believe the story goes that he went out and got his PhD at 41 years old. So that there's a, there's a lot of motivation and drive and a lot of passion and a, a lot of mentors uh, to learn from. And as we all know in the military, we need leaders to look up to. In the civilian life, we need mentors to look, look up to. We need mentors to kind of guide us on the new path of life where a lot of service members don't know how they transition into the civilian road, whether it be through their infantry days, their scout days, whatever job they had in the military, uh, especially for some of the younger service members. Well, what qualities do I have that will provide me with a future in the civilian world, well, strong leadership, discipline, the list goes on and on. We're providing, uh, I guess, providing a way to get back to our communities in a different way, through employment, through helping out within the community, being able to give back financially after you make it and become successful in the civilian world. So continue looking into Florida State University and find out what the Entrepreneur Bet Boot Camp for Veterans is about. Thank you. It is 
10.30 at night. I've been up since 6. Lights out. I'll see you tomorrow.